Number four, now you can eat breakfast at 1040 instead of lunch. Ron, I think one of my favorite stories of you is how when I spent a year in your room and the kids were crowned around the desk, you put up a line of duct tape that the kids couldn't cross so I'd have my own personal space. So thanks all three of you. Number three, no more lesson plans. And Ron, you will ever have to fight another woman for a bathroom um, during a passing period or lunch. Um, thank you for everything that you did for us and for myself and going to miss you in athletics. You were in the best, best tournament ever. Penny. I first met Penny when I was teaching 64 kindergartners back in 82. Not all in one session. Number two, your wardrobe can include more than orange and blue. Gee, I have to say it's uh, just been amazing to have been a student of yours in seventh grade and to return now at the end of your career to teach with you for one year. The first time I remember Paula Miles is um, she walked up to me just like this. Be careful everybody, brace yourself. Hi, Paula Miles, sixth grade, science. And the number one reason that you people are retiring is that you will have much more time to read. We had a lot of fun with those 32 kindergartners, except when we had to put them on in jumpsuits, snow suits, snow hats, snow mittens, and boots and hats, and go outside for recess. By the time 32 kids went out to the playground, it was time to circle around and come back. Penny, I must bow down to you since I now have become the popcorn master for reading Renaissance Day. Paula came here. As a young thing, teaching, not gym class, I've learned not to say that anymore, physical education. To uh, Paula, Ron, and Penny, uh, congratulations on, on your retirement. I hope you uh, enjoy life after school. And she was one tough cookie on the mats. And one assembly, she just went on the mats and performed gymnastics, and everybody was like, <sighs> Can't believe somebody can do that. Uh, you won't have to go to the bathroom uh, every 50 minutes. You don't have to wait. Uh, but it'll be interesting uh, to, to see, uh, see you guys in the future. And I, and I really hope that uh, you enjoy everything uh, life has to offer. Thanks to all of you for your years of inspiration to all of our children. Enjoy retirement to the fullest. Oh, and Ron, could you please stop sending me science magazines addressed to the Sue check? I'd appreciate that. Thanks. As you finish out this week, we want to say our goodbyes and remember that you are always welcome to come back and visit, to crash our staff lunches, um, to sub and Penny to bring brownies. Penny has been known as the brownie queen of our school. Uh, we'll miss her brownies big time for our potlucks. Paula, Miss Watson, when I had you, um, enjoyed your class. Thank you for everything you've done. You've, you've been a great friend, um, taught my own children, and they still remember the things that the, the jello and the experiments and, and soccer, and thank you for everything you've done. Ron, we're truly going to miss you. I know on the first day um, that I started school, you had a big smile, wanted to know where I came from, and from that point on, you have been more than helpful. Um, we're going to miss your old school ways. Um, greeting the officials as they come into the building, greeting the opposing team, help escorting them to the locker room. And the worst of the whole thing is I think I'm now the oldest in our middle school. So I think I am now going to definitely be the mom of the school. As a colleague, it has been wonderful working with you and seeing how you individualize for each student, how you are master teachers, that have everyone's best interest at heart and work so hard for all of those kids to learn as well as they can and to put things in place for them to succeed. You will all be missed. Penny, thanks for being my man at work. You're such a strong lady. I admire you very much. And Penny, the first time I met you, the most elegant person I've ever seen. Um, and getting to work with you, I, I really appreciate that. <laughs> I'm crying, I'm going to miss all of you. Um, 
when you can you give me a brownie recipe before you go? I'd appreciate that. And you have molded and mentored so many students, and I can't even begin to tell you the amount of people that have come into our building and have come to visit you and said, you used to teach me. And that has come from parents and grandparents. Happy trails to you. Hi guys, I'm Eric Carter, son of Jackie Carter. And I'm Tim Miles, son of Paul Miles. Between the two of us, we spent a lot of time with you three retirees. Some more than others. I was in Mrs. Deeth's sixth grade class that was team taught with Mr. Connell, and a Mr. G's science course, which he also taught to my oldest sister, Antoinette Carter, who is now 32, and my two younger sisters, Lauren and Madeline, who are 20 and 13 respectively. Quite a spread. I too was in Mr. G's science class and Eric and I were teaching assistants uh, in high school for his class and of course I was taught a number of things outside of school by my mother. Now both of us are at Michigan State University pursuing PhD degrees in microbiology for me and plant pathology for me. So we just want to thank you three for being a part of the path that led us here. Each of you have contributed to our success and we would like to congratulate you on your prestigious career that have not only shaped our lives but so many others. You will be missed. Thank you, Miss Deeds, for always being so patient with our class. We hope you had a great sixth grade year. Well, miss we'll miss you. you. Miss Deeds, you're an awesome teacher, and we'll miss you. Good luck pursuing under other interests. Miss Deeds, thank you for everything you've done for us this year. We'll miss you. I love being in your classroom. It was a whole bunch of fun. Bye. We appreciate how much you've helped us throughout the year. We'll miss you. My name is Becca, and I have a question for you. Why do you have three different jobs for three different cats? Take lots of vacations, Miss Deets. We love we you. Love you. <laughs> Happy retirement, Mrs. Miles. Fun. Have fun. I hope you get your books published. You rock. Hope you can come visit us. Bye. Thank you and happy retirement. We love you. Mrs. Miles. Mr. G. Mrs. Dietz. Thank you for all you do and we'll miss you. <laughs> the first story he ever told us was he brought in uh, the thing that they make Pepsi bottles out of and he stuck it on his finger and it went <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for all your 28 years of dedicated to us. We love your little boogers. One, two, three, four, six CO2. Now what you gonna do is add six H2O and light energy flow. The yield C6 H2O O6. That's a photosynthesis mix. Now all you have to do is add six O2. Work. Thanks for the help, Mr. Miles. So to summarize, I want to just say good luck to all three of you. I wish you nothing but happiness with your families and in your retirement. Happy, happy retirement. retirement. Enjoy your retirement. Just wishing you a good retirement. Yes, I wish only the best for all three of you. Good luck and have a great retirement. And I wish you the best of luck. Have a wonderful retirement. Just thank you for being the person that you are and the class that you are. Congratulations on your new step in life and good luck. You will all be missed. Okay, so what can I say that hasn't already been said? Other than, Kim's making me do this because I didn't want to. <laughs> okay, now I gotta All get right, it so just, even lower, yeah. So I can, I mean, I didn't know if there was a time frame you had to get this in on because okay. I was gonna watch it. On behalf of the Middle School Science Olympiad team, we'd like to thank you for your years of dedication and hard work coaching the team and instilling a love of learning science in all, in all of us. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh. 
Thank you for all your 28 years of dedication. Love. Can we start over? But also as a parent who had the experience of experiencing. Oh, mess it up. Huh? I just was going to say something about each person, but yeah, you can do that. That's what that's okay. what everybody's everybody's okay. saying stuff about all of them. So, okay. uh, you're you're ready? Do you want to wear your badge, or do you want to take that yeah, off? Yeah, I'll take that off. Okay. I'll start out a little shindig. So, um, and you, okay. <laughs> Happy trails to you until. Smile, <laughs> so 